hi you guys welcome to my channel if you haven't subscribed go ahead and hit the subscribe button so today we're gonna test out this uh, launch creator elite version 2 uh, so it's a scan tool so we're gonna check it out and see how well it works now this thing is a budget one so if you need a scanner and you on budget this is the thing you want Okay. Now, now this thing is um since it's a budget, it's basically it just this one is specialized just for Toyota, okay? Toyota and Lexus. So um you can buy the ones for all the other brand like specifically just for Chrysler or specifically just for GM or BMW. So this one is specially just for the Toyota and the Lexus. But you can expand that and I will show you later. So uh, when you open the package, come with the manual, you got your cable, and you got the unit itself. So the screen is 4 inch, but I think the actual screen right here, the small one, is probably like maybe 2.5 inch. Uh, it's very tough. Look like it's very durable. And on top you got the charger port, the USB-C, and then you got the OBD one, um, and then the power. And uh, basically that's it. So when you turn it on, uh, you got the launch, and uh, get on with the software. So basically that's it. In the back, you got that, and that's it. It's pretty tough, look like it's pretty tough. Uh, it's a very nice sign, it's good in your hand, it's um, very comfortable in your hand. So it's really nice. I like it. So if you on a budget, this is what you get. So basically, you think about it, this is just, um, instead of buying the more expensive one. Pardon me for my neighbor. Every time I'm doing a video, they always come out and turn on some kind of sound so here you got it uh, let me uh, plug it into the car and we're gonna test it out and see how it works okay all right give me a second okay so um so I got the cable plug in I got the car turned on so let me show you what's the setting they have uh, so we had you you got settings so basically you change uh, language and all the other stuff um, in here and then when you go back uh, you got uh, the mall mall which is um, because since you bought uh, I bought this um, specifically just for the Toyota because I have a Toyota vehicle uh, later on if you decide you upgrade to another uh, manufacturing or you bought another car that's a different manufacturing and you still want to use this unit so basically instead of buying the whole unit you can go into the mall and you can add that software in so basically like let's say if you bought an Audi you can buy a Audi software that install into this um, this uh, scan scanner and you can use it so that's what the mall is all about and um, you got upgrade upgrade basically is just whatever software you have you can update it uh, it's a free update so when you go to OBD2 so let's check that out. Let me show you what what it looked like when you go to OBD2. Go ahead and go enter. And yeah, this is what you get right here. So they give you a lot of information about it. Go go to relay um, live data. And they give you all this, so you basically just give you direct um, access to all the important thing that you need, data that you need. Uh, so, like I said, it's basically it's just like a shortcut to go to the important data that you need instead of you going to the other. Uh, Instead of you go to the main option, this one, Diagnost. Uh, Diagnost is more like an overall. This one is 
specialize go straight into um, the problem so that's what OPD2 and let's go straight into the diagnostic and let's try to do diagnostic and they have RA tech so RA tech uh, it should um, automatically take your, your VIN number for your car and uh, like I said this come with 2 gig of RAM a 16 gig of memory uh, storage so um, you should it should uh, run pretty decent um, then your cheap and uh, inexpensive uh, which is $50 the black and white screen uh, scanner this is a lot better okay so um, 16 pin and like I said you know since this is a budget one um, you don't expect the performance of the the, the, the expensive one okay compare don't compare the performance of this to the very expensive one because um, you, you they supposed to cut everything down so you can save um, money by buying this okay so this is great for DIYs since uh, this is basically all they got all the important stuff that uh, DIY uh, uh, at home can use um, to troubleshooting the car this come with bi-directional um, function too and also come with ECU um, offline coding so it's a very uh, good unit if you on a budget and you want something uh, m a little bit better than your very the very inexpensive thirty to fifty dollar kind. This is uh, the one you want. So basically, if you're thinking about it, the expensive one it's just basically just like a Lexus. You got all the accessory and all that stuff that basically you don't need, but it's there, so it look nice, you know. So this thing is more like a, a Corolla um, uh, scan tool, right? So they got everything that you important that you need is in here already. So it gonna get you from point A to point B uh, without all the unnecessary stuff because they can remove all that. So so you can it can cut costs. So it can bring saving to you. So based on what I been using this and what I compare to this to the the more expensive one this thing run pretty well the launch software is actually very good um, they got all the necessary stuff you need so uh, let's see I got two of them um, and everything else is good oh let me get this up this thing tend to fall off uh, so it's good now to share one you can click on here and then you can email to uh, whoever you want to share this report to um, so everything looked good uh, let's go back and so I got code P1604 uh, which is fine um, somehow when I first bought this car until now they always have this code and I never have a problem with it. so um, so I'm not gonna deal with that. So go ahead and go to uh, and check some light data. That's when I want to go and see check light data. So when you go in here, you got actuation test, which is bi-directional test, uh, and you got special function. Special function is basically is um, is uh, they give you look all this stuff. That's a special function, right? Special setting, customized setting is basically is for um. ECU offline coding. So I have a video about that. So if you want to check it out, you go check it out, or you can do research if you want to. Let's go back and let's go read data stream. So select all, okay, and it show you exactly this. As you can see, when I scroll like this, if you have a slow um, scanner you will see a lot of lag and this thing is uh it's really good as you can see when i scroll up it's really smooth so as you can see the performance how good the performance is this uh it's just this uh value um scanner see see how good it is it's just really smooth when you scroll it so that's just tell you how, how good the scanner and how good the software is. And launch software is very good. 
uh, I like it a lot. So of course, as you can see, it's uh, it scored really well. It's performance really well. It's really smooth, uh, as I expected. Um, look at how 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 much information you got here, and of course, I got no misfire. Look at that! How good it is. All right, and then when you go to graph, like you can see the graph right here. It show you. I think this support up to four graph, so uh, so that's it's really good. Combine, let's say combine. Let's say I do uh, how many graph can you like? Let's say four. It's supposed to be four. I think we do it four, but let's say four, five, four. Okay, so you can do four graph at the same time. So ain't that cool? As you can see. And uh, when you click it, it 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 moves. See that? See, uh, it's really smooth. So performance well, really good. So um, like I said, this is really good uh, unit. If you're on a budget, this is what you sh um, I recommend you you getting it. If you just want a uh, a, a a more better, a little bit better uh, than your regular black and white um, scan tool, and this is it. You know the software is great um, the speed is there as you can see and um, they give you all the stuff you really need it um, as you can see and then of course it let you clear the code if um, if you wanted to and overall it's a it's a great uh, it's a great um, scan tool and they give you all the option you need um, expansion if you bought some um, new car that's not the same brand that you bought for this so but this this basically you get the all the important stuff that you need and you don't get all the junk stuff that you don't need from uh, if you buy a more expensive uh, scan tool that they give you like let's say I only own you only own uh, two manufacturer uh, car let's say you only owe the Audi and the Toyota and then they give you a whole bunch of other software uh, in there like all the other car and like Acura or um, a Chrysler and stuff like that or GM and then basically you never were gonna use those I mean those uh, scan tool is good for the shop but um, it's basically for you it's useless because if you are uh, DIY you don't need all the other software so but you're paying for it and then you also have to pay for um, your subscription every year uh, which is uh, cost hundred and hundred dollar right so you got this one you got free update uh, if you want to expand you can expand just for a little bit more cost uh, like uh, we see before is like fifty dollar uh, for a, a not a manufacturing uh, update so uh, Basically, it's a it's a it's a good tool. It's a very a good and uh, you got your money worth. I mean, this is uh, to me. I think if you're DIY, this is the best thing you want. Uh, you don't want to pay a lot, but you want a lot of important stuff uh, that you can use um, that require for a scan tool. And this is it. I think this is even better than the one you go into um, AutoZone or you go into those. Uh, um, auto parts store that they scan the code for you this is better because uh, I went to that before and they got one of those simple the the kind of um, the black and white uh, screen one that basically they just pull out the code and that's it um, this one is more than that and this one have more function than that and this one is a lot better and it's pretty fast too so uh, base for the the money you pay for it uh, this thing is uh, it's great and uh, basically uh, I'm just gonna go a little shortcut on this I mean uh, a little uh, overview on this uh, so you know uh, if you getting this unit you know exactly what are you getting what what kind of stuff they have in here so um, so I don't want to make a really long video because it's basically is um, so much stuff in here that uh, it's gonna take a long time. 
um, so this is just a short video uh, to let you see uh, what are you getting when you buy this uh, the budget uh, launch tool um, so this is uh, creator elite uh, version 2 so uh, nice screen everything look good and I would highly recommend it if you don't have uh, a lot of money and you don't want to waste a lot of money on uh, uh, the unit that uh, you only need a couple of function uh, the, a couple of important function so uh, I recommend it if you don't have money this is what you get so I have this in um, my video description the link to buy it if you want it go ahead and go in there and um, it will take you to Amazon and you can order from there so uh, that's just a little sh overall um, review of this um, it's pretty cool um, scan tool launch scan tool and um, if you have any question go ahead and put it in the comment and uh, I'll try my best to answer for you alright so that's it for this video and I'll see you guys on the next video okay alright alright bye